everybody. Welcome back to another awesome day, another awesome vlog. Today I have a video for you. We're going to make a cool little Christmas gift that you can give to people. And I'm also gonna teach you how to make the wrapping for it. Let's get started. This is the packaging for what we're gonna make. And they are cute little wine charms, a set of four. And they make a great gift. People can use them for parties so that people can keep track of which wine glass is theirs. So these little packages open up like this. And then inside is your little bag of wine charms. And then they unhook like this. You put it around your wine glass and close them up. Let's get started. Okay, so I have several different beads. I have a lot of silver beads and then I also have some colored beads over here. You can purchase, these are just the rings. You can either get them at Michael's, you can get them on Etsy, you can get them in gold or silver. But this for this project, we're gonna be using silver. I'm gonna take four of these out. These are actually hoop earrings is usually how they're sold. They already have the little hook in them. You're gonna take some flat little pliers and you're just going to bend that piece down so that it's straight. I'm gonna do that on all four of mine before I start putting the beads on. And now I'm ready to get started. So I want a very small bead to be on either end so that I'm sure they're not gonna slide off over this once it's up and closed. So I'm gonna start with a small silver round bead to go on first. Next, I'm gonna choose some color. And for this one, I'm gonna use these pretty turquoise beads. So I'm gonna put on one turquoise bead and then I'm gonna follow that with a little bit bigger silver round bead. I'm gonna put that on next. And then I'm gonna use these really cute little heart beads and I'm gonna put on a heart just like that. And now I'm gonna continue so that the other side matches. So I'm going back with a little bit bigger round bead and then a turquoise bead and then a tiny bead to end it. I'm going to use my pliers and I'm going to bend this little piece right back up like so and then close it and I have this really pretty wine charm finished. And now I'm gonna make the rest, but for each one, I wanna make the colored beads a different color so that each charm is different and people can tell their wine glass apart. And now to make the packaging, you're going to use a 10 by 10 piece of cardstock, and I'm going to fold it in half like this to make a large triangle. So just from one corner to the next, just like this. And then I'm gonna fold the edges in to make a square with an opening at the top. I'm just gonna use this as my guideline. And then these pieces tuck into each other.
like that. Now you have an envelope. You can fold these little pieces over. I'm gonna put my wine charms in a little organza bag. You can get these a pack of six at the dollar store. I'm just gonna drop those inside, pull them tight, and then I'm gonna put this in my little packaging. And I'm gonna close it up with some twine. Just tie a bow. To hold it all together, just like that. This is the set that we made in the video up close so you can see what they look like with the little hearts. They turned out really cute. And you can make all different types of wine charms. This is a different set that I made earlier using some different beads and another set using even some smaller multicolored beads. All right, everybody, I hope you enjoyed my video. I hope you learned how to make a fun craft, something that you can give to friends, family members for Christmas, tie them on a bottle of wine, just give them to them as a gift if you're just looking for a small stocking stuffer. They're quick and easy to make. You can get the beads really inexpensively at Michael's or Joann's. I hope that you enjoy making wine charms this season. Don't forget to smash the thumbs up button and don't forget to subscribe.